motion sensing technology to interpret a user's gestures and translate them into commands that can control the exoskeleton's movements. For the sake of demonstrating our project, we have only made a hand, but further installments and changes can be made. Exoskeletons are already present in the market, but they usually require a human to be inside it or are controlled by a remote. A gesture-controlled exoskeleton will bring a whole new era to robotics and exoskeletons. Materials required 3D printed parts, super glue, jumper wires, MG996, R180 degrees, servo motor, fishing wire, Arduino Uno R3. We have sourced the models for the parts from Inmo. The hand works by using multiple motors which are continuously adjusting some strings. The strings are connected to each finger of the hand in such a way that a pull can cause the finger to fold and a relaxation can cause the finger to unfold. We can use this combination of string and motors along with 3D printed hand to make the hand move at a push of a button. The code connects the, with the camera and allows it to recognize the movements of the hand in the format of binary code. 0 for closed, 1 for open. It then sends this data to the Arduino which operates the motors. The code is written in Python and C++. This exoskeleton will redefine society in multiple ways. A few are, it can be used by firefighters in places where us humans can't reach. It can be used in the army and border regions for remote fighting. It can be used in factories where there is repetitive work and also where heavy loads can't be lifted. The development and implementation of gesture-controlled exoskeletons continues to advance, offering promising possibilities to improve accessibility and augment human capabilities in various fields. <laughs>